Crawl Daunt. Uh huh. Interesting. Cry all you want, I'm riding you to battle. Oh, there's a pins here. Yoink! Pins here! Yoink! Cross that off the list. And yeah. Let's get rid of. Nope. I want to get rid of some stuff. And yoink. So, pins here. Cool, cool. Joltik. Whatever that is. Let's get away from that. Zep, Zurich, welcome to the stream! <laughs> Finally, you made it. Welcome, welcome. And uh, thanks for following, actually. I saw that in the chat message popping up earlier. So, uh, yeah, welcome to the club. Sandshrew, <laughs> uh, I already have. Yeah, I'm under the impression that um, during night time, a lot more Pokemon spawn in desert and others. And do we have a chest here? No. Hmm, would have dropped up some stuff. Uh, dropped off. Nah, anyways. <laughs> I don't need that Drapion or whatever that is called. There's a uh, Surviper right here. Hmm, Lady on. Uh, yoink. Oh. Let's get rid of some stuff I don't need. I don't need that. Sorry, I'm... This is all stuff you don't need. This is useful stuff. Uh, that as well, but the rest I simply don't need. And it's only cluttering up space in the community chests as well, so I'm getting rid of that. If somebody wants to save it, uh, you saw where it is, so <laughs> be my guest. Ah, do we find more Pokemon we need in the river biomes? And Whipstitch left the game. Oh, this is either a shiny or a boss. Since it is a boss, I shall fight it with Raikou. Yoink. Raikou, spark. Oh. Okay, this is interesting. I thought it was a water Pokemon, and that Bro. electricity would do something good. Hmm. Ha, ha, ha. Bro. Uh, you haven't missed that much, Zep. Um, showed off the museum. I can do a flyby of that later on, so, um... Oh, Tyrant has grown. Eh, some more of those. Yeah, I can do another flyby of that later on, if you would like to. And um, we have gotten a few Pokemon off the list again. I'm missing around 40 to 50 right now. 40, 45 maybe. I don't know the exact number as of now. Hey, Squiznuts! And... Oh. Yeah, there is Arcanine. Yoink! Thank you very much, Squizzy. That is perfect. Thank you. If I can now find it, I can cross it off the list. There we go. Arcanine. Thank you. <laughs> uh. Right. More Pokemon off the list. That is good. Oh, Raikou is unable to battle. I want Moltres to fly. Come here, yeah. Come here, you. Stop screaming and come here. Hmm. We don't need those. Ductrio. Lavita. Let's do a quick scoop around. Many weird Pokemon. Ah, hello, Cubone. There we go. Hello, little guy. Welcome to my collection, Cubone. You can cross that off the list. Very good. Thank you very much, little guy. Much obliged. 
and screws not uh, suffocated in a wall. Well done! <laughs> I don't know how that is possibly uh, possible that easily, but uh, apparently it is. So hooray for that. <laughs> hooray for suffocating in a wall. Hmm. Okay, I'm... I... <laughs> oh, okay, that, that actually makes sense. And it's a little bit uh, frustrating, but uh, oh well. So, I do need to find a desert for Vulpix. I don't think I can find it in a mesa, or not that easily, at least. Uh, in terms of Ivysaur, I will find an opportunity. Yeah, but as for now, let's get down the list. Ivysaur and Chameleon. Um, both spawn very rarely. Hey, second generation starter Pokemon evolution. Croconaw. There we go. Uh, oh, Meowths. Interesting. Yeah, Plains Biome we need for Persian. Uh, which is not running around here as of now. Beach Biomes, I don't know. I don't think that Cloister would spawn naturally. So, we can't wait for that. Oh, there is a Cubone right here now. Now that I got one, a lot of those spawn. Well, thank you. Thank you very much. Uh... There's a desert near the village that has a nether portal. Then we shall visit that. Yoink. Okay. Oh, I can't use Raikou, so I have to be on foot. Nah. Well, I could just use the poker center. That would be the sensible thing to do, but uh, I'm not all the time for sensible things, as you might know by now. Ah, there we go. Um, let me actually see... Um, yoink. And available Pokemon. I'm looking up in the... Ah, what do you call it again? The wiki? And I do want to look up Vulpix and Ninetales. Savannah and Savannah. Okay. So, Savannah would be a good effort to go for. Persian, I already know. Mankey and Primeape should be jungle. Oh, yeah. I know that on the edge of the world there is a jungle biome. Meh. Uh, as for the other ones, Magnemite is Mesa. No, Cold Beach, Frozen, Ice Plains. Oh, right, yeah. was one of the very, very rare ones. Cloister spawns not, uh, doesn't spawn naturally. Moving on. Uh, Executor doesn't spawn naturally, so we need to evolve something for that. Um, Chansey should spawn in Savannah. Very good. Starmy spawns, uh, doesn't spawn naturally, so we do need to evolve a star you for that. Uh, Pinsir, I got uh, Eevees. I have to give stones for Vaporeon, Jolteon, Flareon. I only have two Eevees as of now, or one Eevee, so I want more Eevees for need more Eevees for now. Ammonite um, is from the Helix fossil, and Kabuto is from the Dome fossil, so I should see if I have those. Okay, so um, for now, Pokemon we can find naturally River, Savannah, and a very cold biome, so Savannah and... Yeah, pretty much Savannah biome is what we want to go for. And evolving Pokemon. So, we know what to do now, more or less, <laughs> and so let's visit that village for now. No, nope, swamp. Uh, that village was a little bit more to this side, I think. 
Boink. Oh, there was a crossing right here. No idea where that, that leads. There is no sign there. I am not following that path. It is a non-marked path and I don't think it would be a sensible idea to go there. As well as that one. Let's see. Village should be near this portal right here. Yep, the village. The village. Ah, I, I still have coffee left. Mm. It is cold. Blah. Not that good. But still, it's coffee, so um, it is good by definition. So, Verta said that there should be a desert around here. Um, don't care about the desert as much as the savanna, which we found right now. So, we should keep our eyes peeled for Chansey and Vulpix and Ninetales. And Nidorino, uh, while we're at it. Uh, because I couldn't get that one last time. Well, this looks like somebody has been gathering some sand. And I do have my bet on Verta. <laughs> Blame the Verta. No, we don't do that. That would be mean. Yeah, um, we found the desert. So, uh, those weird blue things I have no idea about. Uh, Ekans, there's a Nidorino! Yoink. Yoink, Nidorino! We can cross that off the list. Awesome. Stop screaming. That's unprofessional. So, Nidorino and Nidorino, right over here. Another Nidorino, now, well, as per usual. As we don't need any more Nidorinos, we will now get thousands of them. Uh, and before it was harder to find them. That happens every time with every game with anything you could need. <laughs> every time. Okay, this is uh, one of the Generation 3 evolutions. Uh, starter Pokemon evolutions, I mean. Uh, I don't need Tauros or the Dodoro. All still Savannah. More Mesa over there. Ah, uh, Mesa uh, Desert. Cypher we already got, as well as Arbok. Another blue thing. I don't even want to learn the name of that blue thing. It's just the blue thing. <laughs> ah, because I'm too lazy to learn the name. Right. Um... <laughs> Why would you do such a thing, Verta? Hmm, I don't know. Because you have a huge project which would involve a lot of glass. I don't know. That seems like a reasonable bet. Oh, he, we are here. The awesome looking uh, Mesa, uh, um, Mesa, uh, Savanna biome with extreme hills mixed into it. Right, I do remember now. I was thinking at some point that I might do, um, or build an arena right here. But then I decided to do that in the, um, yeah, everything is Mesa for me. That's a Mesa, that's a Mesa, that's a Mesa. Everything is Mesa. We don't have that in Germany, so everything is a Mesa. Everything which looks different is Mesa. <laughs> you get a Mesa, you get a Mesa, everybody gets a Mesa. Okay, <laughs> enough of that already. Uh... So, far-fetched. I am. We already got those, so. Not interested. I am, though, interested in Vulpix. So, if you could supply me with a Vulpix, nice Savannah. See, I called you at, at your right name this time. 
I would be so happy. I don't think I might need to wait for night time for that. Huh. This this tiny Pokemon. Nidorin? Ah, Nidoran uh, female. Huh. Come on now. Spawn me some nice Pokemon. <laughs> Oh! Oh! Look at that! Look at this! A dungeon! Yoink! Meh! Ooh! I will grab that. And the rest can other people can have. Hey! A pig spawner! <laughs> cool. Cool! A sunken spawner. Yoink! We don't need the sand, so let's put that around here. Yeah, sometimes you are lucky to find one of those. And if you're flying around, it's even easier. So, hooray for that! Hooray for a spawner. But only the, the one enchanted book, so... One measly enchanted book. Meh. Wasn't even worth the effort. I expected some diamonds. Oh, Vulpix. There we go. Hello. Ha ha ha! Vulpix! There we go. Ninetales would be the next one then. Um, I don't know. Maybe I have that in my box or a Vulpix, which I could evolve. I think at one point I got one of those to evolve and to um, put in my team as a fire Pokemon. Uh, Nido King or Nido Queen? Actually, I always went for Nido King to be honest, because he has the better ground attacks, um, and uh, of course the poison attacks are stronger. Or it was just my thinking that they would be stronger, and uh, in reality they are both matched. I don't know. I'm uh, a first and second generation Pokemon player. Uh, the generations after, when you had uh, higher, of course, another Vulpix. Didn't I say something about that five minutes ago? Uh, of course. Yeah, um... So, the stats in the first two generations were pretty much not an issue whatsoever. Uh, that came in the later generations as far as I'm aware. And uh, it's a cool thing, it mixes up stuff, but... Uh, I couldn't be bothered with such a thing. So, Growlithe. They do now spawn in vast quantities. And I'm still waiting for Nine Tails. Persian as well. Uh, but I don't think they would spawn here. I can fly back into the other direction though, because there was a normal plains biome nearby. Oh! Again. Hello! Cool. Eh. We got a berry! Hooray! Nobody uses berries. <laughs> um, they are... Well, they are not useless. I wouldn't say that. Uh, they do have a nice range of effects. And there is nine tails. Hello. Hello, dear. Hey! Stop! Yoink! Gotcha! Nine tails! Nice! Nice, nice. Okay, Mankey and Primeape don't spawn here. Um. Nope, nope. I'm just going through the list. Chansey would be the last Pokemon to spawn right here. So, I would like to take my chances in actually getting Chansey so we ha uh, don't have to make another trip to a Savannah. I don't know how often or rare they are, though. So, uh, we will see, I suppose. And let me get some more film. And, yeah, you know what? Ep, ep, ep. Don't need that. I do want Pokemon in my inventory. Or at least pictures of Pokemon. <clears throat> Sorry. <laughs> Let me take another sip. 
Mm. Ah, that was the last of my coffee. Hmm. 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 Uh. Oh, I just read that. Uh, read that. Uh, Zeb Zorik. Um. So purely from design, I would go for Nido King as well because I. I don't know. Um. They made Nido Queen. Well, I. I don't want to say look inferior. Oh, and another one. Oh, a heavy ball. Can always use balls. Um, I mean, Nido King with its purple taint, uh, he does look meaner and s more s more strong, stronger, stronger is the word I'm looking for. Damn it! What is with my language today? Yeah. Um. So, uh, it just looks cool, th uh, cooler. Thank you, Verta. Thank you for that insight. Ah. Yeah, um, it, it does look cooler altogether with the purple taint, while Nido Queen with only greyish. It's. I don't know, it, it just looks more plain, more a more lazy design, maybe? Yeah, welcome to the stre stream, Zeb Zurich. That is Verta for you. Right, there is a Meowth here. And Eneko, nobody wants Eneko. Let me make a, a quick pause. I do need a sip of water as well. Mm. Ah, there we go. Okay, Persians. Oh, and another item. Let's see. Yoink. Nobody needs. Yeah. Uh, nobody wants a moonstone. Yoink. Hmm. I do know that Persians only spawn at night, so let's see then. Chansey, I don't know, uh, which is why I'm staying at the edge of the savannah, so that we might get incredibly lucky and get a Chansey and a Persian in the next few minutes. Uh, well. I suppose there was uh, something behind that question. So, uh, tell us, Zeb, what uh, what's your favorite from the z design aspect and why? Yeah, I I just did. <laughs> uh, I will choose Zeb from now on. That is uh, shorter and uh, yeah. <laughs> Normally, I'm lazy as fuck when it comes to things like that, so, yeah, um, aww, I, I only said that, uh, thanks for the insight, Verta, and, uh, told Zeb that, uh, that is what you do around here, you take those comments and put them totally out of context to discredit me, so, that's pretty much it, <laughs> now you're up to speed. And I said thanks. Yep, that is right. <laughs> I did say thanks. Uh, come on, give me a chancy. What is... Ugh. Weird thing. Hmm. More awesome extreme hills. But still no Persian has spawned. Um, when I was farming around in plains biomes before, they tended to spawn in the later parts of the night, so after midnight maybe? I don't know if there is any uh, actual difference. I know in the Game Boy games there is, but um, even in the first ones. Oh, there is a Jigglypuff. Don't know if Wigglytuffs even spawn uh, naturally. Uh, since Clefable does, I would suppose yes, but uh, eh, I don't know if logic will help us here. I suppose not. Hmm. Ah, there we have some spawns. Uh, only survey, only survivor. Uh, come on now. More streamlined, okay. 
Huh. I guess you can say that. Uh, Nido King is quite spiky, you could say. Ah, oh, my throat is killing me. Mm. Yeah, um. I don't know, because of that streamline, maybe I don't like it that much. <laughs> I always went for the male Nidoran and trained it to get a Nido King. And um, in the old games, he always was on my first team. At least until I replaced him with something uh, bigger, better, or completely different. So, yeah. Uh, what? What? I have no idea what you two are talking about right now, and I don't know if you would uh, would I if I would want to know. I would guess not. <laughs> uh, I can hardly keep up with Twitter, to be honest. Since I um, don't use my smartphone really. Uh, especially not for Twitter. I only see it once in the evening time when I check Twitter if there are any notifications, but uh, I I can't keep up with all the messages. Oh, seriously, Verta? <laughs> why? <laughs> why? <laughs> see, that's why I didn't want to ask, but I did ask, so yeah, my fault. Okay. <laughs> okay, cool. So uh, we are we have now a discussion about the shapes of Lake Michigan, <laughs> and the entire night no Persian. So I think I will have to go into different planes for him for that. One minute, I have to look at the Chansey spawning, if she spawns at day or at night. Only day, okay. And she has a spawn rate of 0.3%. That is not a high spawn rate. Okay, so I will um, take half a day then to scout the area for a chance Chansey. I do know that Squizzy has one, so uh, I could go for that if I can't find a Chansey in the wild. I would like to uh, find her in the wild because, like I stated in the beginning, uh, this is what this whole challenge is about, to find most of those Pokémon, or um, if possible, all of those Pokémon in the wild, or train them myself. But... Um, yeah, it it is a lot harder than you'd think. Oh, another item. Thank you. Skill swap. Nah. Nah. Yeah, scream for it. I know. That's an Ekans. Hey, Crusader. Nice to see you. Welcome. I don't know where everybody is. Um, maybe because I'm streaming later than usual. Um, I left my announcement video as my uh, trailer on my channel, so everybody got to see when I'm streaming, but, uh, yeah, I don't know. So far, only a few people showed up, but uh, that makes it more intimate. And don't forget, it's Friday evening. People have stuff to do on Friday evenings. People go out, or do other stuff. So, yeah, <laughs> only a few here. Ah. So, spawn chance you spawn. What is that thing on the ground? Wow, Tito. Huh? Um, actually, I do want to catch that. Um, yeah. Well, thank you. Dragon Rage. 
Dragon Rage. Yep, perfect. Bag, Pokeballs, uh, <laughs> Ultra Ball. Uh, <laughs> Zeb, why would you do the same like Verta? Oh no. Now I have two of those. Seriously. <laughs> I don't know if it's going to be fun or a torment. Uh, and Dito is defeating all my Pokemon. How about a heavy ball? Just because I want to get rid of it. If I'm able to catch it now, I will be a little bit angry. There we go, okay. Cool. Pokeball. Ultra Ball. Uh, <laughs> that might happen, Verta. That might happen. Aha! There we go. I captured Ditto. We already have... I don't need you. Go away. Okay, yeah, uh, we already managed to photograph it uh, last time with Squizzy. So I'm good on that, on these terms. Ha! But still looking for Chansey to show up. As of now, we weren't able to find it. Yeah, last sweep around the area. And uh, afterwards, we will return to spawn. Yeah, I don't see a chancy here, so um, I think it will be no use to stay around here until it spawns. That would be too much. And now, watch me falling to my death. Uh, and um, yeah. We didn't see a chancy spawning while I was falling, so that's a relief. So, for now, let's put some Pokemon into the chests, shall we? We got a Butterfree. We got Haunter, uh, which comes later. Okay, Pinsir comes later, that comes later. Cubon... Um, Wallpix... Yeah, and Ninetales, and Nidorino. There we go. That looks splendid. Arcanine, and Cubone, and before Haunter was... Uh, okay. Here we go, there we go, where does Pinsir go? Uh, comes after Star Me and Star You, so in the last box. There goes Pinsir and there goes Rhydon. Very good. Very good. Um, I'm leaving this right... no, this I need. But this stuff I will leave here, so we can do that later on. Now, um, let's go through my Pokemon boxes. If I have uh, stuff for that, I think Kabuto I got rid of, unfortunately. So, we do need an Eevee. So let me put some Pokemon into the box. Yoink. Eevee. And we will take a random stone. Or, what do you people think? Which one of the uh, Jolteon, Flareon, or Vaporeon? Which one shall I do? Um, which one should I evolve? Evolutionary items. I do have all the stones, so uh, I could go for any of those. Thunderstone, Waterstone. So, Thunder, Fire, or Water. Um, I have some fossils as well, I think. Either here... I know I put them somewhere. Uh, or I donated them. Okay, Kitsy votes for Flareon. Any opposing votes? <laughs> 